I mean, it's it, we're getting big names that, like for example, Chris Ramsey, Jason Cook, that have always said that had this place been here when they first started out, they wouldn't have moved away. I mean, I think that's the, the next step for us is developing the newer talent now and hoping that we can kind of build that in Newcastle and get people to stay. If there's a good local club and you can travel, there's no real need to move away. I think Newcastle, if anything, has been neglected. Like you've, you've got good clubs in Manchester, You've got good clubs in Glasgow and, and Edinburgh, but in Newcastle it didn't have its own dedicated comedy club. So I think it just seemed like the next step to give them like that kind of triangle and also move move down into England. Well, it's great, isn't it? It's a great room. Probably was a warehouse one time in history in the middle of Newcastle. Couldn't be better, really. After all these years of struggling, there's a club in Newcastle that lets me do what I want on a Sunday night. Fantastic, man. What difference would it have made having it what in the past? Yeah. Or, uh, obviously you never know, but it, were, it could have been seismic. I think we could have had comedy stores from here. We, we have had a, few, a couple, but I think we could have had 20, 10, 15, maybe even 25. Maybe it had nobody. A lot of local promoters doing like nights in kind of pubs, different clubs and stuff like that. Um, I don't think having like a dedicated club like the stand in Newcastle is really going to affect them with anything. It's just going to help grow talent in this area, which can only have a, a good effect on ourselves and other promoters in, in Newcastle, really. If you look at Glasgow, like Frankie Boyle and um, Kevin Bridges are both products of Red Raw, which is our amateur night. So, I mean, if that's anything to go by, if we can do something even similar here and get a name from Newcastle that gets gets recognised and, and, and does well within the industry because of the stand and because of Red Roll, that's a fantastic thing for the stand, for that comedian, other comedians in Newcastle as an area really. Thursday through till Saturday, as you know, is our kind of big, big show. That's our big bill. Then there's Gavin Webster's North Roman Assembly, which is, which is growing and doing really well. Northern Assembly is a Sunday night show at the stand here in Newcastle, the Pontain, I compare it. We um, have three acts. There is uh, a meat draw, there's a comedy quiz, and uh, various other unique items. What's a meat draw? A meat draw is um, when, when the crowd come in, they fill in little forms with their name and address, put it into a hat, we draw out the winner, and the winner wins some tinned meat. You know, ham, bacon, grill, a little bit of all day breakfast, beans and sausages, meatballs, all the quality meats from back in the day. Would you like to see some of the meat? Um, afterwards. Yeah, okay. Absolutely.